my sunflower field on my couch. this fall. Oh, it says you're only 6'3". Hey y'all. Hey. I'm Hannah. And I'm Jeremy. And we are the Savory Suitcase. Yeah. And today we are at Southern Hill Farms. We've come here for their fall festival um, and we're trying very hard to beat the rain. So we'll see. We're filming this. Trying to do it quick. Yeah. Got a couple snips in. And then we'll go look at their pumpkins and the other stuff that they have here. Yeah, so. they got all kinds of fun stuff. So they got all kinds of goodies and snacks and games and little stuff rides. Stuff cover, most importantly. So. Yep, they have lots of cover available over there. So yeah. we'll we'll probably have to stick to some of those things. But we want to do the outside things while it's not raining. Yeah, so let's pick some sunflowers. That's a good one. Yeah, let's get that one. Oh, I don't know. The zinnias are one dollar. The sunflowers are two dollars. And we're gonna go back to the tent so we don't get rained on. Because lightning it is and thunder. Th there is thunder, so. But look how beautiful. All the Instagram moments. Yeah, follow us on Instagram for all of our. Purple couch moments. All of our uh, travel vlogger photos. <laughs> I'm really bad at this. Got your I, travel vlogger hat now, too. Yeah. We're not talking about the hat. Now, listen. Okay, so listen. The hat is a sensitive subject. I'm going to take this. Excuse me. I'm going to go this way without you. <laughs> the hat is a sensitive subject. When Hannah bought the hat, she <laughs> piped down. She sent it to me and I said, oh, I said, you look like Pharrell Williams. That's yeah, I, okay. No, that's not what I said. No, no, no. Hold on. Set the record straight. I said, it looks like Pharrell Williams. She took that offensively. I have nothing against Pharrell. Pharrell's a cool guy. Get out of here. So. <laughs> I wasn't saying that she looked like Pharrell Williams and I was not making fun of her. I was simply saying that the hat reminded me of Pharrell Williams. Insert photo here. This is what her hat reminded me of. This is what her hat is. Here's a, ha a picture of Pharrell Williams with that same hat. It looks the same. Not a bad it thing. It does not look the same. It does look the same.
got a sampling of a couple of different things um, to try. We got the, blue, I've already, I wasn't supposed to taste this yet, um, but I couldn't wait for you. You guys took too long to get here. <laughs> I'm sorry, um, but be quicker next time, okay? Um, this was only for our subscribers, so if you're not subscribed, that's why you missed the first part of it. <laughs> So, sounds like a you problem. Anyway, um, so this was a blueberry white chocolate chip cookie. There's like a lot of oats in it. It's crumbly, it's moist, it's sweet, it's it's delightful. Um, Southern Hill Farm is known for their blueberries. They do blueberry picking. Um, they also do peaches, they do strawberries, they do, depending on the seasonality of, of the fruit, um, they do some different stuff here on the farm. Um, this place is huge. I've never been here, never heard of it. Didn't even know that this was here. Uh, it's beautiful. Um, and Hannah's gonna show you off to the right. Um, they have um, a dessert food truck, which is where we got these things. This is all stuff that they make here. So, um, and then they also have a an, an eatery, a Southern Hill eatery. So they have regular food as well. So they have a full offering of food and dessert and drinks. It's it's a pretty hefty cookie. Like it's a pretty dense. It's not too sweet though. It's a good balance of like the odiness. And the blueberries, like really, there's like fresh blueberries on top, and white chocolate. It's a good, good, like good balance of salt. Um, it's a really, really good cookie. If you like a good oatmeal-based cookie, like oat-based, um, and you like blueberries, you're really gonna love this. Um, they also had some muffins too. They had a pumpkin muffin, uh, and they had blueberry muffins. Obviously, like a lot of their offerings are blueberry-based year-round because that's kind of their thing. Um, Hannah's gonna tell you about the two fall things we got, but. The other thing I got, which I also started because it took you too long to get here, um, was the Southern Swirl, I think it was called. So it's their blueberry lemonade swirled with vanilla ice cream. Uh, the, blueberry the blueberry lemonade is gone, and uh, I'm working on ice cream now. So delightful, refreshing. So I got the fall offerings. I got the frozen apple cider. I asked the... Um, waitress I don't know the girl checking us out which one was better and she was like I don't know they're both good so <laughs> she said this one was a little more refreshing and since it was kind of warm earlier it's not warm now because it's going to rain but um, and then we also got the apple cider donuts um, I think these are like one of the things that they're known for for their fall festival they were really cheap though they were like a dollar a donut which I feel like is less than you would even pay at like Dunkin Donuts so yeah we're gonna be in a sugar coma here pretty soon so nap time yeah. Tractor ride? We don't know what the tractor ride does or where it goes, but we saw people getting on, so we got on. Oh, 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 
some stuff some stuff and things we bought some uh, kettle corn for family maybe maybe not I'm a sucker for some kettle corn yes. and it's blueberry so yeah. um, you know but luckily it never did rain nope. it threatened for a while sure did. but it never did so you can come back April through May April and May for blueberry picking uh, as well as peaches. Apparently uh, on the tractor, I don't know if you're going to be able to hear some of the stuff he was saying, uh, but also April and May, they do the peach picking as well. So the peaches over here, uh, they don't ship the peaches because they're supposedly some of the best that you, you, you can get in the state of Florida. Um, they don't ship them because they're too tender or too soft and juicy. Too delicate. Delicate peach. Like a delicate peach. Like Hannah. Like me. We ate the popcorn. <laughs> All right, that is gonna do it from Southern Hill Farms. It's a really nice place. Yeah, it was cool. Bigger than I thought. Yeah. I, I, you, know, I was... you, you didn't really know what to expect, so. Sure didn't. I do all the research. I came in completely blind. Yeah. I've seen this before, because it's, it's definitely a popular spot, I think mm -hmm. on like Instagram and stuff. Um, so I've seen people come and do the blueberry picking and the peaches and everything. So I really wanted to come for their fall festival. Very reminiscent to me um, of Hunsader Farms in, mm. in size and scale. Yeah, in um, Sarasota. And down in Sarasota, yeah, so complete opposite direction from where we went. But uh, yeah, super cool. <laughs> Very nice place. I know, this is why I don't like popcorn. Yeah, I have popcorn. It's, it's worth it. So what? Popcorn, it's. What's an it? Like the skin. Oh, the thing your dad calls it. Thank you so much for watching. We really appreciate it. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do so. Click the bell. We make the new videos every week of different places around Florida and sometimes other places. Sometimes beyond. So we appreciate you and we will see you next week. See you next week. Bye y'all.